Hi guys, MAG here. Welcome back to Planet Coaster. Another episode. So, um, as you can see, we're continuing to do our fantasy zone, our like medieval um, fairy tale type zone. Uh, in the past couple of ex uh, episodes, we finished off this kind of dragon zone, <coughs> which is over here, which is the sort of part of our fantasy zone. <coughs> you start off in the dragon's lair, all the witches and the wild wood and the scary stuff and all that business, and you walk across our awesome bridge here. In fact, I think I'm going to go for a walk along the bridge now, if I can come into this mode. Uh, yeah, we walk walk along the bridge, uh, and then we go over to the... Ooh, it's daylight. Then we go over to the... Um, to the village zone. I wish I knew how to get rid of these path curbstones. So here we go. And this is us then in the village zone. Um, so I'm going to show you, very quickly before we start putting a ride in, how I managed to make this sort of plaza here so the dudes can still walk around you can see that they're, they're not really clipping into it they still walk around fine but um they uh they, it looks like they can go wherever they want in this whole sort of uh, plaza section here but of course they can't but um i'm sure most of you know how to do this already but uh, there is a way of doing it and uh, i've kind of partially done it you'll see if i come over here you can see that well look <clears throat> this area here still needs to be dealt with but i'm going to quickly go into um into a previous video I did, uh, and then I'm going to do a voiceover of that, um, and then we're going to come back and put put a ride in, and I'll show you about these these uh, these buildings and whatnots over here. Right. So what I'm doing is I'm just putting in these these paving stones. I've, basically, these are these are horizontal pillars, uh, but I'm going to use them as 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 uh, kind of barriers to to tell the guests where they're not allowed to go. Uh, now you can see that I've put a path down on the. Um, where, where the guests are, I'm happy for them to walk, but it's not very neat. And I've put like scenery in the gaps amongst the path. So basically, the guests cannot walk through the scenery. They have to walk down the paths. I then take a roofed flat roof tile. In this case, it's um, this uh, this nice sort of paving stone style, and I cover up all of the all of the uh, path. And then very quickly, you'll see I just drop it down so just above the level of the actual landscape. So all you can see is just the top of the uh, the paving stones poking out. So what happens is that when people walk on it, it looks like they're walking on the paving stones. They're actually walking on the paths, but because the paving stones are so... I've, I've lowered them to the point just above the level of the path, it looks like they're walking on the paving stones. And then what I do is I go around with all my various shrubberies, and I start to, um, to fill in all the gaps. This is also... A good excuse uh, to actually go and do the shrubberies because um, it looks terrible. Parks look terrible without being full of flowers and bushes and stuff. This one over here, I've kind of treated a bit like to be like a bit of a herb garden around this little castly type house, strange looking house. Um, so you got uh, you got the. I do apologise, mate. That was my people checking now to see who's <laughs> to see if their iPad just binged. That was my one. Um, yeah, so so t turning this into a bit of a bit of a herb garden type thing. Um, there are some greenery still left in there, left in there, so I leave that open. I put a rock in there as well. And what I always like to do as well with these things is to is to stick stick a few lights in there as well. To, I think that really makes it look nice. Stick a few lanterns hidden amongst the the plants. Really uh, adds to the effect. I thought about keeping that paved area there because it looked like a bit of a paving area for the garden, but I thought no, it doesn't it doesn't look that good. Um, so I, yeah, I tried try to find a bit of a let's stick that thing in there, that monolith type thing in there. Um, I'll probably move them, pot them plants. I think one of them's actually sat on top of the fence there. Thought about putting a parrot in there. Decided eventually to go for a princess and uh, stick a load more more plants in into the uh, into the herb garden. Same thing. Just finish off putting these uh, these stones over here. These. Uh, pavings but all and there you have it um, so this is where we're back up to date again now I've moved you'll notice I've moved these guys around um, so these all of these uh, this kind of market impromptu um, gypsy market stall or whatever whatever you want to call it um, these were all this side of the of the castle wall of the uh, stable wall but I've moved them because um, it didn't look that great over here uh, that bush is sort of completely in the wrong side of this what's that bush doing there for I don't want to edit the building. I want to just delete that piece of uh, bush there. Okay, I'll have to 
Oh, maybe it's all part of the building. Oh, there we go. So we're getting rid of him. Um, so yeah, I must have put them sceneries in as part of the building. Not a problem. Right, so we did say we were going to put a ride in, didn't we? So we need to attract people over to this side of the park. Because at the moment, the only reason they're coming over is for the shops. And I need to have a look at those offline. Because I need to make sure that I've actually got the right shops in there. But we do have new rides available to us. Because I did some research. So if I go to research now. Okay, well, actually, let's do some more research while we're waiting. Uh, in fact, I'm not going to do any more research yet. Because I don't earn enough money just yet. I go to rides. So we've got... The Forge. Okay, the Forge looks quite good. I suppose it's, I don't know, is that medieval? I don't think so, but we'll do it. We'll, I mean, I'm not going to try and theme the, too much the the ride to the area it's in. Um, this looks much more spacey, but uh, still, we, we can still put it there if we wanted to. And we've got this thing here, which is um, some sort of a spinning type um, thing. Or we've got Roctopus, but I'll put the, probably put them with Pirates. So if I go now on to, uh, so that was Thrill Rides, what about gent oh, Gentle Rides? And let's look at Track Rides, what will be unleashed with Track Rides? We've got the Boats, we've got Steam, which we've already got. We've got Popeye's Wild River Adventure. Ah, oh, now this is a this is a mod, that we, so I don't want to do that one. Wait, that's it, go rid of that. Crankshaft, and we've got the Boats. Ooh, what's going on? Why is it all going so crazy like that? What's it doing? Um, uh, oh, we've got coasters. Uh, Dragon we've already looked at. Grendel we've got. Mm, Nepithis. We've got Oblivion. Um, we've got Rebel, which is a train one. Screamer. The madness and, and whirlwind. We've got those types of. Uh, so I'm gonna, I, I, I'm gonna put a, a, a thrill ride in. So I quite like this look of this forge thing. So what do we think? Maybe stick forge over here. I'm gonna move these um, tents. I think at some point. But I might just put forge in over here. Right, he's in. Can't think about that anymore. Let's uh, line him up. So I need to place an entrance. Um, so I'll put an entrance around this side. Around here. I'll put the exit here. And connect the entrance path. So what is the path we're gonna have again? Let's see, we're medieval, so we're in the our fantasy world. We could do some wood cube. I think we'll do cobblestones for this. And let's put um I think we can put the, the advanced settings, yeah, okay, so we can put curb on ground path, yeah, railings on ground queue. We'll put some railings around this one. Do our usual and follow the curve of the ride. Just bring it right side a little bit so that we can put some flowers or something down there. Uh, yeah, we'll keep going like this. Keep going like this. Okay, I think that's oops. I think that's long enough. So now what we can do is we can go to paths. There's cobblestones. Now I want to take these off again. And I want to put this one. This is quite a wide path here, isn't it? Yes, we'll keep it as a wide path. We'll put him in sort of like that there. And then we want to make the path smaller for this bit here. Uh, and we'll come in like that, I think. Pressing Z or Z makes means you can join up in slightly different angles. Like that there. And then we'll go back onto that one and we'll just join those up. Like, uh, I don't know, it's, uh, no, it doesn't look too great there, does it? It looks like it's got a green bit. There's a sort of a green wedge missing. Oh, no, I've, I've turned those um, railings on the queues off as well. 
I'll turn the car off. Let's see if I do a Z, what happens. Hmm, that doesn't look brilliant, does it? Hmm, come on. Come on, I don't wanna I don't wanna queue like that, I wanna queue in normal fashion. Maybe I just have to do a big Z here. Right, I think I'm gonna have to see I'm not very good at it. <laughs> People are watching this boy screaming. Oh dear. Anyone else would have would have would have sorted all this out beforehand, but not me. Not me. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna extend the path out, then I'm gonna come back to this thing. And I'm just gonna do a basic queue up. There. That would do us, even though I've not got the railings on again, because I'm an idiot. All right, so you can go and add them afterwards. That's clever. Didn't know that. You see, we learn something new every day. This ride is open. And it's going to cost you 10 bucks to go on it. Alright, so that's one ride over here that's open. Hopefully we'll start getting some more people now wandering across the ways. Uh, and we need to put another ride on. So, uh, see, now you notice I haven't finished this bit over here yet, because I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this. But, we definitely need to put another ride in. So, what says we put a, a more gentle kids ride in? What have we got? We, we, teacup, I don't think, teacups is definitely for, like, fantasy world, isn't it? That's definitely for over here. So, I think... Maybe we'll put teacups around here behind the this whatever this house thing here is. Uh, maybe we'll put it over here by the over here maybe. But then what am I going to do with this here? I need, I need yeah. I think I need to stick it in here. To be honest with you, I think what I'll do is I think I'll turn. Where is it? Can I turn. Oh yeah, I think I can turn the the outside of it off the um, the, right, the bit where you see the path so I'm going to put stick this one just in here there it's done uh, we'll put the entrance around here and we'll place the, pl place the exit over here over here because this is basically where I want them to be able to and we'll connect the path um, <clears throat> what I'll do this this one is let's should we take a look at natural see what, oh. I don't think natural oh no natural works if we put it over here doesn't it yeah we'll put that in there and then we'll go for a normal path which we'll go for a brick one yeah and for this one we'll just do a little bit of a oh Oh crikey, that's not going to work. Right, yeah, this one should work a bit better. Oh, <laughs> I'm terrible. I don't know why I'm making it a wibbly wobbly like this. For I mean, it's it's uh, <laughs> a bit pointless. Oh, feel some flowers or something in there. I don't know. Right, we'll do that there. Oops. We'll do that there, and then I need to put another another path on. Um, so we need to go to paths. And we need to go to that one, and I'll put on um, cobblestone like we were doing. But I need it to be wider. Over here. Width. Four meters. Is that right? No, it's this one here I want. Width ten meters. Is this going to allow us to come past? Uh, go there. Can't quite go there, so we need to make it a little bit less wide. There is a key for doing this, changing the width, without having to um, keep coming back over here. But I can't remember what it is. I saw it in another video. Uh, we'll do this here. Uh, I think if I hit control, I get to do it like this. Oops. And then I can come over to here. 
I don't want it. I want to do that again. I don't want cobbles around it. Thank you very much. <sighs> oh, uh, maybe it's because this one here. Oh, no, it was definitely that one there, wasn't it? I don't want cobbles there either. I want bricks. There's bricks. There he is. And... Oh, looks like we're going to have to we're going to have to make it cobbly. That's a slight disappointment. Still, um, okay. Oh, uh, no, no, it is. It is a slight disappointment. Okay. <sighs> okay, so that was probably a lot, lot, lot more difficult than it needed to be. Let's turn this one on as well. So now we've got a couple of new rides. I'm down to fourteen thousand dollars. So um, hopefully the peeps will start walking across here at some point soon and, and start going on these rides. I need to put bins and stuff before we forget. So we've got uh, scenery, I think it is, isn't it? Um, path extras. Bins over here. It's definitely got to be palace bins, haven't they? Definitely got to be palace bins. Let's put some palace bins down. People can throw their litter in. We do not want litter on our on our uh, our park. These poor dudes have already got enough to do already. Come on, let me in here. That's it. Better put one down pretty close to sort of well, just about everywhere. People don't walk through bins. We'll put on there as well. Also benches. Look, we've got these throne benches. So we'll stick benches in as well. Uh, there's throne benches. There's throne benches. Let's sit next, next, up next to the herbal garden. Over here, so people can sit down. Right, okay, it looks good at night. I like the look of it at night. So we've got 1,700 people now, almost 2,000 people in the park. That's good. Do I need to put more, more caretakers in? I probably do as well. So let's go back to park management. Let's go to the staff. Let's click on that dude and let's pop him down over here. So he can start doing his cleaning. Right, so a couple more rides. I need to I need to beautify these rides. I need to do something to break up all of this horribleness here. I'll, I'll move these, I think I'll move these, uh, these around here. Let's do them now. If I hit M. That now me. Whoa. Control Z. If I go to that thing, hit M. What the? Oh, look at that. They're, they're, they're attached to the other piece of scenery. That's not what I wanted. Um, can I remove it? Advance move. Duplicate. Move. Edit building. Let me have a look. I think I can split from building. Good. Uh, and so that's him split from the building. This guy, I want to hit split him from the building as well. Hmm, okay. So let's just check for now. I can move this guy separately. Good. So that's what you, that's a little thing you got to watch out for there is that you don't end up connecting up buildings that you don't want to connect up. Same for this guy here. Okay, should be able to move him. Oh, no, that's the. <laughs> He's connected to the toilets. <laughs> right, so I need to I need to, to get on with that. Um, <laughs> I need to get on with that in my own my own time. Let me see now. Click on him. Okay, split from building. Good. Um, this guy here. Split from building. Okay, good. What about anything else? Don't think there's anything else connected. Uh, so I'll do that. I'll do that in my own time. And uh, I'm not sure what we're going to do next. We're going to. Um, I think we need to continue having some stuff. I need to put. I need to build some more, some more buildings because I don't have enough buildings on just at the moment, and um, to make this into a proper themed area. But I'm thinking we probably need to have a roller coaster over here as well to to bring the people in. We we'll probably have a roller coaster per themed area, um, and maybe a little fun like choo choo ride or something. Take us round and down into the main part of the park. 
down here. Maybe something like that. Um, but that'll be for the. I'll have a think about that and I'll start making some progress and I'll get back to you on the next episode. Um, so, as usual, it started out with the best intentions, but then I demonstrated I'm rubbish at this game by getting things wrong, like this this area here. And though it's daytime. Oh, Orvo Fagan mechanic has quit. Why, you lazy get? There's me park summary. How much am I making? Cash flow. <laughs> Losing a lot. It's going to be building so much. Well, anyway, you guys, uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks very much for watching. Cheerio. Bye bye.